everyone, welcome back to Krish Tech Me. I have got some news about Windows 10 and that's gonna affect your computers. Yes. So it's a serious news guys, Windows 10 will be officially terminated by Microsoft. So a few days ago, Microsoft announced that they will cancel the support of Windows 10. Basically it means they will not give any driver updates or any other security patches or any, you know, support for Windows 10. So the people who are using Windows 10, they'll do all these things from October 2025. Yes, you still have another one year. You need to be active and uh, you need to search for the right solution and I'll give you the right solution for it. So if you see the launching date of Windows 10, it is 2015 and now it is 2024. So Windows 10 is 10 years old operating system and they just want a new operating system. So that's why Windows 12 is coming. Yes, you heard it right. They are working on Windows 12 and uh, they will launch it soon. So 40 million computers around the world will be dumped in the landfill. Yes, so the computers which is running Windows 10 currently will be dumped into the junkyard or scrapyard. I don't know how they will recycle all those computer parts and all. So the computers which is running Windows 10 will not support Windows 11 or 12. Like some old computers which is running Windows 10, they will not be having that much of system requirements. You will be knowing the system requirements of Windows 11, 4 GB RAM and some faster CPU, TPM 2.0. Yes, the main thing guys, like Windows 11 requires TPM 2.0. Many Windows 10 computers doesn't have this TPM 2.0 feature. So what they are doing, they are still using Windows 10 because yeah guys, Windows Windows 10 is like the best operating system and it doesn't require any high system resources or high-end specification or even TPM access. Windows 12 is based on AI. Your processor should be fast enough to handle the AI. Microsoft is implementing artificial intelligence in Windows 12 so it will be very good. So guys I'll be making different parts of this video. So this is the first part. I'll be making another one or two parts. So guys subscribe and hit a like button. So now I'll tell you the best solution for this. I know this is gonna be challenging for some people but here's the thing. The first thing you have to do is upgrade RAM. So if your low-end computer is having 4 GB RAM, then upgrade to 8 GB RAM or 16 GB RAM. Like try to increase the RAM as much as possible and just see the frequency of the RAM module and also the version like DDR3 or DDR4. Now the second thing is upgrade CPU. So if your old computer is running low-end CPU, just change the CPU and boom, your computer will be you know supported for the latest Windows. So just check the CPU compatibility in the motherboard by going to the official website of the motherboard and you can see the list of the support. CPUs as I told you before about the trusted platform module TPM so you can buy TPM online so you will get TPM module online on eBay's and other websites so if I get the link of the product I'll give you in the description buy the TPM module install it in your motherboard and you can just check the videos online and you'll get to know if you install TPM module on the motherboard you can install Windows 11 directly guys without any problem and these are the three things you should do to make Windows 11 or 12 run in your old computer bye